in the back. Um, the cockpit's not answering. Somebody's stabbed in business class. And um, I think there's mates that we can't breathe. I, I don't know. I think we're getting hijacked. Which flight are you on? Flight 12. And what seat are you in? Ma'am, are you there? Are you in? Well, so we just left Boston. We're up in the air. I know. We're what? supposed to go to L.A. and the cockpit's not answering their phone. Okay, okay but what seat point. are you sitting in? What's the number of your seat? Okay, I'm in my jump seat right now. Okay. At 3R. Okay, you're the flight attendant? I'm sorry, did you say you're the flight attendant? Hello? Yes, yes hello? What is your Hi. name? Hi. You're going to have to speak up. I can't hear you. Sure. What is your name? Okay, my name is Betty Ong. I'm number three on flight 11. Okay. And the cockpit is not answering their phone. And there's somebody staffed in business class, and there's, we can't breathe in business class. Somebody's got mace or something. Can you describe the person that you said someone is what in business class? Um, I'm, I'm sitting in the back. Somebody's coming back from business. If you can hold on for one second, they're coming back. Our number one is, got stabbed. Uh, our person is stabbed. Um, nobody knows who stabbed who, and we, we can't even get up to business class right now because nobody can breathe. Uh, our number one is, is stabbed right now. Okay. Uh, and and our number five, our first class passengers, our uh, first class uh, galley flight attendant, and our purser has been stabbed. And we can't get the cockpit. The door won't open. Yeah, I'm taking down all the information, and we're also, um, you know, of course, recording this. Um, at this point, this is how operations. What flight number are we talking about? Flight 12. Flight 12. Okay, no, we're on flight 11 right now. This is flight 11. It's flight 11. I'm sorry, Nitty. Boston to Los Angeles. Yes. Our number one has been stabbed, and our five has been stabbed. Can anybody get up to the cockpit? Can anybody get up to the cockpit? We can't even get into the cockpit. We don't know who's up there. Well, if they were shrewd, they would keep the door closed and... I'm sorry? Would they not maintain a sterile cockpit? I think the guys are up there. They might have gone the, down their way up there or, or something. Nobody can call the cockpit. We can't even get inside. Yes, we're still here. Okay. I'm staying on the line as well. Okay. Hi, who is calling reservations? Is this one of the flight attendants or who who are you, hon? She gave her name as Betty on. Betty? Yeah, I'm number three. I'm number three on this flight. And you're the number three on the flight? Yes. And, and this is I flight eleven. From where to where? 11. Have you guys called anyone else? No. Uh, somebody's calling medical, and we can't get a stop. American Airlines emergency line, please state your emergency. Hey, this is Nitty American Airlines calling. I am monitoring a call in which Flight 11, the flight attendant is advising our reps that the pilot, everyone's been stabbed. Flight 11? Yeah. They can't get into the cockpit is what I'm hearing. Okay, who's this I'm talking to? Excuse me, this is the American Airlines at the Raleigh Reservation Center. I'm the operations specialist on duty. I'm sorry, what was your name again? Nydia. Nydia. And what's your last name? Gonzalez, G-O-N-C-A-L-E-C. Reservations. Okay. Now, the flight attendant on the line with one of our agents. Okay. 
and she's calling out. Through reservation. I can go in on the line and ask a lot of kind of questions. Okay. Uh, uh, I'm assuming they've declared an emergency. Let me get ATC on here. Stand by. Got any contact with anybody? Okay, I'm still on with security, okay, Betty? You're doing a great job. Just, just stay calm, okay? We are, absolutely. Okay, we're contacting a flight crew now. We're, all con uh, we're also contacting ATC. Okay. It seems like the passengers in the coach might not be aware of what's going on right now. These two passengers were from first class. Okay, hold on. Hey, Betty, do you know any information as far as the gentlemen that are in the cockpit with the pilot who they from first class? They were sitting in 2A and B. They are in the cockpit with the pilot. Who's talking to them? Is there a doctor on board? Is there a doctor on board, Betty, that's missing you guys? You don't have any doctors on board? Okay. So you've gotten all the first class passengers out of first class? Have they taken everyone out of first class? Yeah, she's just saying that they have. They're in coach. What's going on, honey? Okay, the aircraft is erratic again. Very she did say that all the first class passengers have to move back to coach. So first class, the cabin is empty. What's going on on your end, Ted? Uh, we contacted air traffic control. They are going to handle this for the confirmed hijacking. So they're moving all the traffic out of this aircraft's way. Okay. Uh, he turned his transponder off, so we don't have a definitive altitude for him. Uh, we're just going by, they, they seem to think that they have him on a primary radar, they seem to think that he is descending. Okay. Yeah. Okay, Lydia? Yes, dear, I'm here. Okay. I have the dispatcher currently taking the current fuel on board. Uh-huh. And uh, we're going to run some profiles. Okay. To see exactly what his endurance is. Okay. She doesn't have an idea who the other passenger might be in first. Apparently they might have spread something, so it's, it's um, they're having a hard time breathing or getting in that area. What's going on, Betty? Betty, talk to me. Betty, are you there? Betty? What do you think you lost her? Okay, so we'll, let, we'll stay open. Wait, I think we might have lost her. 